I love how he has male and female dancers. Mm-hmm. Hi, everyone. We are... La Chimola. La and we are back with another music video reaction, this time to one of our favorite boos, Juan Ho. Oh, yes. <sighs> and his brand new single, Eye on You, which just came out today. Yeah. Um, and we are very excited about it. Obviously, mm-hmm. we've been watching all the concept photos, all the medleys, anything, just desperate for a little piece of what this would be yeah like we watched the teaser we watched the high, highlight medley yeah the yeah. highlight medley oh my goodness ah the obsession picture uh. the purple and the eyes <laughs> love oh it my gosh. Love it. oh so good oh uh. i'm just like really really excited and just based on you know the first frame which we obviously can see it looks like it's going to be something super like cinematic and dramatic so i'm into that <laughs> I, I mean look it's snow you know <laughs> i mean i'm in california and hello snow, california. it's already drama it's already dramatic <laughs> i mean come on la and rain don't mix <laughs> so i mean snow really wouldn't mix yeah snow really wouldn't mix <laughs> at all but uh, we've both been very good and we have not listened to the track yet so mm-hmm. should we just dive in yeah, let's okay. dive in. Here we go. One first, ho, I love you. Woo woo. Here we first go. Look. Oh, oh, already love it. I love it. <laughs> Woo. That sure is crazy. Oh my gosh. My control. Oh, this dance already. Ooh. Whoa, that was a cool transition. Right? Ooh. What a sexy vibe. Yeah. I love how he has male and female dancers. Mm-hmm. Ah. Snow oh. harness? Oh my. Oh my. Ooh. Ugh, like, he looks like an assassin, right? Oh, look at that. Love it. Oh. Oh my gosh. <gasps> These transitions are really cool. Mm-hmm. Oh, wow. Colors. Oh my gosh. Shut up. Whoa. 
That was insanely gorgeous. Oh, uh, loved every second about wow. it. Wow. All right. Wow. Okay, let's talk about the song. Okay. The song is, I will have to say it's, it's weird, you know, to say that. <laughs> no, no, it's weird that it, it doesn't sound like Wan Ho, but it's Wan Ho, you know, mm-hmm. like the, 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 uh, like I, I can't put my finger on it. Like, it's, I think it's the instrumentals are very different than the last couple things yeah. he's put out, mm-hmm. but the lyrics and the voice voice as well. I mean, it's <laughs> yeah yeah the, the the beat is definitely very different you know um yeah. for sure and what which is like really amazing and I love this is because it's the same producer and I mean one ho one ho had written this you know along mm-hmm. with you know a whole team and it's the same person that he wrote this song with with like blue I think yeah uh blue oh. letter yeah so they're blue the letter it, yeah it's the same like same team it's the same team know. but it's a very different vibe very 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 different vibe um the sound was very very like sexy oh the words are mm. clearly you know <laughs> and there was a lot and... of like bass and like there's that pulsing kind of beat it was much more clubby yeah um in the best way yeah, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. And so, um, yeah, so I, I, I guess that's what I'm trying to pinpoint. Like, yeah, it's, that's exactly what it is. You know, like it's very, it's more clubby, you know, than mm-hmm. I'm used to, but yeah, the lyrics are all one home. Like, I mean, yeah. Tim, you know, he's wrote it together with a team, but I mean, like, yeah, yeah like, you could, oh. <laughs> like, <laughs> well, I feel like the last thing we watched was his like, sweet Japanese song that was like let's be in love and mm-hmm. like go steady yeah and this was like I see you at the club I'm gonna go home with you mm-hmm. what do you think <laughs> <laughs> it was just like a very different vibe it was very more um it, yeah it was more in your face oh yeah it was more we've seen him kind of like sweet and and like very boyfriend vibes this was like not boyfriend vibes. This is, uh, I'll, I won't see you after this weekend, but it, what a weekend it will be. hundred <laughs> percent. One hundred percent. And it was really catchy too. I did like the way that like, like I said, when the bass came up and like, there was kind of like a little reverb in the background. Mm-hmm. Um, it really like drew you in because of the sound being like, woo, 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 woo. yeah. Um, so I thought it was really catchy. You knew right away, like eye on you, that chorus part, very good hook. Um, just really good, really good. I mean, one was always okay. good, but really good. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, and, and I mentioned this, like before we started watching this video, like, you, you know, like I was like going through the whole, like one ho catalog because I'm like, oh, I can't wait to like, listen to eye on you. And like, you know, getting myself all pumped up, you know, for this video. (laughs) And like, it's, it's totally different, totally different. And, um, you see a different duality or you see the duality, you know, like, you know, the cute, like sweet, like blue, for example, like, yeah, you know, high school love and all that kind of stuff. And then you see this, this video, it's like, bam, you know, even just his Christmas song, white miracle. Yeah. Yeah. Like, that was all chunky sweaters and you know like hot cocoa with whipped cream on your nose a yeah. very different vibe than different this. vibe this is like but he can do both he can yeah. do a lot and mm-hmm. I think it's smart of him to never do too many in one kind before he's like oh but I'm also this oh but yeah. I also do that like this was a great showcase also for his dancing skills which yeah. we know he's a fantabulous dancer um, and I feel like maybe the last two songs, cause they've been a little slower, you know, it's more been about creating a mood. So he really got to, um, you know, dust off those chops and show them to us. And he choreographs too, right? He does. And now that you mentioned choreograph, I'm going to mention a fun fact to you. <laughs> All right. Lay it on me. I will lay it on you strong. Okay. <laughs> There's four chore- uh, choreographers for this, for this dance. And um, we all know that one, or not just one home, but Monster X and 17 are the best of friends. They're very close. 
he enlisted Hoshi to help him <gasps> choreograph. Ooh, nice. <laughs> how fun. I did really like how it's not just a gesture, the way you turn it. Yep. Um, is really cool because it does make it seem very intense. Like it's, yeah. it, it bumps up the, the dramatics a little bit. Yeah. That's very interesting. Yeah. Wow. It's, it's really cool. Cause like, uh, his comeback was like, uh, well in our time this morning. And <laughs> so, um, he sang a few songs, you know, of course I knew somebody, which is, uh, his other, his B-side track. And then, um, ain't about you and uh open mind but like you know he had like that whole discussion during his comeback show he mentioned that oh. you know Hoshi helped you know that's like, so cool with that choreography so I, I love like, the idea that you know I just like any other artist they have friends that they can reach out to and be like hey you know would you mind collaborating with me on this and it's like yeah sure of course yeah yeah you know and we know, well, we know, we know now, you know, since uh, <laughs> we've been trying to, we're getting to know like 17 right now as well, that Hoshi is part of the dance unit, you know, and he's amazing. Incredible. Incredible. And he's, the, he's the leader of the dance unit. So yeah. it's like, he knows exactly what he's doing, you know, so. So yeah. he couldn't have picked a better person. I mean, yeah. this is a guy who choreographs for 13 people. Pretty sure he can do one. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and we mentioned it during the video, but um Wanho has done this many times. You've commented on it. He loves to use co-ed dancers, which mm. I really like. Yep. I loved how it was almost like a flower. So there's like Wanho in the middle, and then he's there's like a ring of ladies and then a ring of guys. Mm -hmm. You know, like and then sometimes the ladies aren't there, and then sometimes the guys aren't there. Like I thought that was very cool. Mm -hmm. Um, I like that it always it, it's funny he can have I mean at one point it seemed like there were like 15 other dancers on stage but the focus is still him because yep. of the way the movements are and the costumes and everything and I just thought it was so pretty I really love those like uh the lace over the eyes and mm -hmm. then also the lace shirts they were wearing that had full like gloves yeah um those just look really cool it was so stunning like oh like and then like you mentioned in the uh, in the while we were watching too like the transitions you know like they were crazy oh and gosh. there were so many of them and those are so not many. easy those are so hard you have to hit your mark every time you change sets mm -hmm. for those to really work and they did I also liked how the camera when it was doing um like I had talked about the bass reverb mm -hmm. the camera would do it it almost seemed like it was handheld they made it was a little shaky but that was obviously on purpose like it felt like when they slammed their feet on the floor then the camera would shake a little so yeah. it was really I also liked that it made you feel like the camera was your eyes and that you could like feel the beat all the way through your body yeah it's like an experience that they're yeah. giving you you know while you're watching right? it's like you know like where are my 3d glasses I know. no really where are my 3d glasses <laughs> um but yeah i thought that all of that in the production really added to it so great sets um great dancers and then like just the way it was filmed the transitions the yeah it, it, i feel like we're so used to seeing steady cam shots like we don't even notice that they're happening so this yeah. did feel much more like intimate and immediate in a weird yeah. way even though mm -hmm. we were far away yeah I, I also like that scene too um where it was all a bunch of like red yarn yes and that, like he was, was gripping onto cool. it like it's it's again I feel like it's a metaphor of like um like relationships with the that red mm -hmm. string but it's all tangled it's all tangled it. up you know yeah. So it's like, oh, and he's just like cutting through it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and I mean, it goes without saying, but I don't know why he was dressed like an assassin in the winter wool, with like wood with a bunch of wolves, but I like it. <laughs> it's I, a, it I, I, I don't know why, but it's a necessary part of Wan Ho, I feel like now. <laughs> yeah, it, it seemed like a metaphor that like he's the leader of the pack like they fear him you know like he's full of confidence and like yeah and his eyes like when it would glow to the cgi yeah oh, when they would man. make yeah the like how animal eyes do that thing mm -hmm. uh where they like reflect back at you the retina yep. or whatever yep mm. Mm. this is i mean i just oh. didn't realize that i needed 
winter assassin Wan Ho, but apparently I do. <laughs> um, girl, I think we all need some winter assassin Wan Ho. Like, where have I guess you... I just didn't know it was possible. <laughs> where have you been all of my life? You know, <laughs> come on. At least he's finally here. He's finally yes. here. He's here. He's here. <sighs> and... I'm here for it. And yeah, I'm just saying. <laughs> And what about uh, the outfits? <laughs> I'm like speechless. I'm like amazing. Like so good. That flesh colored so shirt that looks like tattoos. Amazing. Yeah. Um, um, the suit. I mean, his sh- the shirt that had like a bunch of holes in it. I mean, come on. <laughs> um. Then the assassin outfit, the street jacket outfit. Oh my gosh. All white outfits, you know, like everyone was wearing white. Oh my god. So and then like I said, the suit that when, when he, he was basically in like all the television screens, kind of. Mm-hmm. Um, ugh, just and you know, just pants. Yeah. Again. <laughs> you know what you're doing. Yeah. You definitely know what you're doing. And I'm assuming that stylist is partly Wan Ho. Because he knows what he's doing. Mm -hmm. He knows what he wants to accentuate. And he does so very well. Yes, he does. (laughs) Yeah, I would not be surprised if he designed all of the outfits, you know, Mm -hmm. that he wore. I bet you he at least picked out that faux tattoo looking shirt. I could see him picking that out 100%. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um. But yeah, it really did add, every costume added like a little bit of like a dangerous edge like you were talking about. The song is a little like... It's saucy. He's stalking you, but like in a way where you're happy about it. (laughs) (laughs) He's like, I see you and I'm going to come get it. And you're like, okay, come on over. (laughs) (laughs) So the um, outfits really added to that. And like you said, he he felt hyper like, um, he felt like the leader. It was very like, assertive and in charge yeah totally take charge kind of well i guess we'll be watching this a lot over the next i don't know year (laughs) i mean i'll be streaming this like endlessly so right on my spotify on the title on (laughs) youtube is this your new hype song (laughs) girl yes it's my new hype song do not be surprised if y'all see me work out to this song yes yes actually I'm gonna, i feel like that's yeah. the highest compliment for one how <laughs> yeah. yes it is you know there's very few songs that i listen to when i need a spot 200 pounds and he is one of them so. and he would also relate yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. i just oh. love this it was so good i'm very excited to listen to this forever in a day and definitely non-stop <laughs> oh my gosh uh <sighs> such a great song i mean like how many times are we gonna sigh and like <laughs> forever and, be and, like, and we'll oh. say it again Juan Ho, please come to the states as soon as yeah, you can I as know. soon as it's safe i know seriously escape omicron over there and come over here it's died yes. down already <laughs> uh, la county 72 percent cases dropped just so you know <laughs> just so you know <laughs> We're available for private tours. Yeah. <laughs> uh, just so good. Just another piece of the puzzle. And uh, I just feel like he he does nothing but improve and get better and better and better. Oh my gosh. Um, I'm absolutely. never disappointed with a Wanho song. Yeah, absolutely. All of his songs are so amazing. Yeah. It, he's had his hand written, like writing it, producing it arranging it like his everything is like he has his hand in it you know like even in the credits if you read the credits like it's his name is plastered everywhere you know so that's why it really feels like we're getting his vision this is totally his vision and I partially think that's why he comes across as so confident and you know because this is something he has actually crafted it wasn't just given to him exactly um and it really shows yeah really shows and it's like a total and it's he's so talented you know like <sighs> so he's good. so talented because when we mentioned this before in other reaction videos that 
not all artists could do this. Not all artists could write their own song, produce their own song, you know, um, and arrange their own song, compose their own song, you know, like, yeah. but he's like the whole package. He mm-hmm. does all of that. He, I'm sure he has like, even though he had four, cor- four choreographers on this, uh, Song. he knows what he wants he's he, the person who got those choreographers in the room right yeah and i'm he has a certain vision i'm sure he gave like his input because he's such an amazing dancer mm-hmm. like all around this is this is like totally it screams one ho, you yeah. know like even though it's a different like i said like i couldn't pinpoint it now i could thank you <laughs> uh, like that clubby vibe like mm-hmm. i mean it's not his typical like cute little pop song that we're like used to you know or that Mm -hmm. usual like dance track that or edm track that we would hear you know but um it's it's a different side of him and i'm all for it yeah you can show us as many sides as you want we'll keep watching yeah (laughs) yep show us all your sides dude also when you said the screams wan ho i thought no we scream wan ho (laughs) wan ho (laughs) <laughs> yes. but i mean thank you for always bringing it back to the weenies we appreciate you i know <laughs> we weenies love you so much love it's true <laughs> <laughs> all right you guys oh man how how long have we been fawning over this <laughs> i'm sure not long enough but long enough for most people yeah i think so too okay maybe we'll (laughs) cut it off right here (laughs) but all right you guys thank you so much for joining our discussion of this amazing song please stream this song buy his physical cd yes obsession obsession yeah i mean i'm gonna put in we're gonna put in our work to stream it and um i already bought the cd singles i'm just waiting for it (laughs) there'll be an unboxing all three sets (laughs) um so um yeah so stream his music please like please he deserves it he works really hard and we love him so all right you guys that's enough from us if you (laughs) if you like this video please like share and subscribe and we are La La Chimola. Chimola. and we will see you guys next time maybe the one hope performance Ooh, i like that <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> 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 <laughs>